Hi again, everyone. So I've washed out my hair. I've done nothing else to it. I can't see yet if I've missed some spots. But what you can see is that my roots, then my mid shaft and my ends are all different colors. So this is partly what to expect. Hi, Scott. I'm happy you're watching. Hi, Natasha. Hi, Shannon. I miss Jessica. I wish Jessica could come on here with me. Maybe um, Shannon, Jessica, and I can do a special show when all of this is over. That would be amazing. Okay, so getting back to this. Um, I am going to use my Nourish Fortify Keratin uh, Leave-In. So that's going to build up my um, keratin in my hair. So strengthen it and even out the porosity. So all I did was shampoo, not condition, because I'm going to have to do another step to this um tomorrow so i'm going to um i'm going to do this first then i'm going to dry it i really want you guys to see that it's not an easy task um so if you were to lighten your hair yourself there's a lot more steps to coloring your hair than you might think so now we discovered yesterday on my live that you guys can still hear me as I'm blow drying my hair. So in order to, for you guys to really see what's happening with my hair, I need to dry it. So again, you guys saw my hair was purple and all different types of colors. Before the purple, uh, it was green. So like a turquoisey type green. So right now as I'm drying my hair, it is, it feels dry for sure. Um, but I'm blow drying my root first. But if I were to leave my hair this color, it would look awful. Very yellow, very orange. Always when you're blow drying your hair, um, some of you that get your hair done with me uh, will know that I always teach people to blow dry their roots first and whatever way you're blow drying it, always make sure the air is going from the roots to the ends of your hair. So blow drying in the direction towards the ends of your hair. Can you see now that this is not a good idea to do your own lightening? With a hair salon or a hair stylist, uh, even me doing it on my own, it's not a good idea, let alone not having a stylist do it. So that was kind of the point of this video is to show you, you know, if it comes to lightening your hair, you really do want to wait for a professional. Um, it's, there's lots of chemistry involved, uh, medications can affect how your hair turns out. Um, Lots of factors involved. I hope you guys can hear me when my blow dryer's on. Hi, Frank. Um, I'm kind of afraid that you're watching. You're one of my favorite mentors in the hair industry. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching. But this is definitely to show people not to do it at home themselves. 
so now I'm going to have to go back in my hair and create an even palette because if I put anything on top of this, I'm still going to have all these, these banding. It's like when you're painting a wall and you have lines of different colors on the wall, it's going to come through when you paint it just one solid color. So it's the same principle with hair. Hair's your canvas, and textures do matter as well, hair textures. Hi, Tina. Oh, I'm so happy you're watching. Just to recap, I did lighten my hair with professional products, um, and my hair was purple about an hour ago, and then I am lightening, or I lightened, and washed it out. There's nothing at this point on top of my hair, um, just the lightener, and I used the Fortify, um, leave-in treatment that most people should be using anyways but I wanted to dry it and show you how complicated the process is. Um, there are lots of products available for root touch-ups that are not chemicals. Well, they're not hair color. Um, so what they'll do is they'll camouflage your um, regrowth, new growth. Um, there's colored conditioners that you can buy either through me or a lot of different companies that you wash into your hair. Um, there's other options out there, but see how my hair is now. Um, it's always brittle. It is obviously drier, but you can see all the different colors in there. So like I said, when you're, if I were to put a color on top of this, I'd end up with all different, um, banding happening. And for sure, if I put blue over top of this, it would be green and more green up at this top portion than on my sides and back of my hair, although it's still pretty golden back there. So um, I'm going to take the um, care to my hair and do a treatment on it, uh, nurture it over the next little while because I am indoors. And I will show you what I do next. Um, and now that my hair is this color, I can do a demo on the conceal products um, to show you what to expect with those. So they are, they look like this. This is my sample. I've had it for a long time. So this is just a little brush. And if I had roots, then I would, oh, it's out, hold on. Here's the auburn one. So if I wanted to camouflage my root, then I would just brush it out and camouflage my root. If I had gray or if I had darker roots and I just didn't want a straight line, I could use a product like this to camouflage it. And then this washes out. So when I shampoo my hair again, um, this will shampoo out of my hair. So, but I'm clearly gonna have to do a lot more work to my hair in order to be able to um, color or tone my hair. So I just wanted to show you guys that uh, these are an option. Most companies, like I said, have these products available. 
Um, and we are taking orders, although you do not have to buy from me. Um, product sales right now are, or gift cards are really the only thing that um, people can do to help support Salon Bliss or other hair salons. Um, so I've had many people um, help. And, um, but yes, definitely product sales really help in order to pay our bills right now. So that's why, um, although I really am doing this to keep myself busy, but also keep you guys engaged and understand the value of a stylist, what we provide is more than just doing your hair as well. It's, you know, we help give you a different um, perspective on yourself. So our hair is um, in our society is really important and it um, can help uplift us and really it's the perspective. You have a different perspective in the mirror of yourself. I mean you guys just witnessed me going from a purple color into this and although it looks much better now that I've blended out my roots to camouflage it rather than this orangey yellow color um, it can, it can make you feel really good about yourself. And I think that is, uh, this time of, um, being separated and isolation, social distancing is really going to show us all how important it is to have that time with our love stylist. Um, and we all, well, I mean, I love all of you and I really pour my heart and soul into um, the work that I do with you and for you. Um, so having said all that, I hope this was a good le lesson that um, lightening your hair at home is never a good idea, even for a hairstylist. So I'm gonna keep working on it, uh, not tonight. Like I said, I'm now going to treat my hair um, and then I'm going to, um, I'll show you the rest when I do it, but uh, more out of entertainment. Oh, Shannon, you couldn't hear when my dryer was on. Oh no. Hi, Nicole. Thank you so much. Uh, Nicole is a um, uh, stylist as well. We both work with Euphora, and uh, she's been really kind in helping me find some much-needed um, support and help that I need uh, and needed even without COVID-19. So I very much appreciate Nicole. I've been in class with her a few times. She's an awesome stylist and a business owner. And um, I'm trying to make sure that I see everything here. Um, yeah. You love my hair. Well, it's not done, Helen, yet. Um, you know, as you know, because we went through the process of cutting your hair off and uh, lightening it. It takes some time. Um, so I'm happy that you like it. Um, and I also would like you guys to PM me if you are interested in product for one. Like I said, that's a great way to support us at this time or gift cards. The only thing about buying gift cards is we're asking that if you purchase them, then when you come in for your visit, because we will be reopening at some point, that you use for each visit up to 50% of your gift card because we could get into a lot of trouble not having new income coming in. So um, that would be amazing if you are looking for ways to help us and support us through this time. Um, and I thank all of you for doing what you can. And you know what? Um, watching these videos are a huge support personally for me. Um, 
you know, my mental health. You guys are giving me a purpose and that is what I'm used to waking up to every day is, is a purpose and you guys and Salon Bliss has been my purpose for a long time and my baby, to be honest. So it was a sad day when I had to make the decision to close the doors for now. It would be a lot easier for all of us if we knew for how long, but um, I know we're going through all kinds of things and um, we just need to stick together. And my team is uh, growing stronger by the day. Um, I'm very proud of them as well. And they're a huge support to me and my family here, of course. And Bailey. Bailey is laying on the couch giving me dirty looks right now. So I'm off to watch Tiger King now and put a treatment in my hair. So thank you so much for watching me and I will see you guys tomorrow. Please PM me with your ideas of the hair color you want me to do. Um, I've done pretty much everything. So I would love your um, input on that. Anyways, love you lots. Have a good night. It's almost, well, my bedtime I was going to say, but I'm really wanting to watch this Tiger King. Anyway, love you all. Good night. Bye.